Uh, resistance in AML is a, a topic that is um, not well defined. So uh, uh, obviously there is a lot of factors that go into resistance. And in fact, just the definition of resistance is uh, uh, it's in itself not completely clear. Uh, this is an attempt to try to find uh, a mechanism of predicting resistance and uh, um, you know it's a large study combining uh, data from multiple uh, centers and cooperative groups uh, so it's uh, unfortunately there is no clear uh, way of predicting resistance even using this large database but uh, I think the one of the biggest issues about this resistance is the fact that uh, different doses and uh, different uh, uh, intensity of various drugs are used and the patients are very heterogeneous. Uh, we never even consider pharmacogenomics in uh, adult population. Patients metabolize drugs differently and different leukemias are going to be sensitive uh, to different mechanisms of uh, uh, drug activity. So um, uh, it's a good attempt, uh, uh, but I think in the future we are going to hopefully actually treat leukemia AML particularly based on disease biology more than just giving the same drugs to all patients.